All right, the Rose City will be in the college basketball spotlight this week. The women's NCAA tournament runs through Portland, and there are some local connections to the big dance. Orlando Sanchez is live from Moda Center with a Sweet 16 preview. Hey, Orlando. Yes, Tim, it is the calm before the madness here inside Moda Center. Eight teams will be in Portland. Six games over the next few days starting tomorrow. One of those teams, the Stanford Cardinal. Stanford, a number two seed led by All-American forward Cameron Brink. This is a full circle moment for her. Brink is from Beaverton. She grew up 15 minutes from here, a state champion at Southridge High, a graduate from Mountainside High, and now her college basketball career is nearing the end of the road, declaring for the WNBA draft where she's projected to be the second overall pick. So coming back to Portland for at least one more game, playing in front of friends and family is special, a moment in her basketball journey, and she's soaking it all in. Honestly, I'm at peace with it, I think, to play my last potential game in front of family in Portland at home is, is bittersweet, but it's really wonderful, and I'm just really happy to be here, and I just have a great sense of peace, honestly, just being here. It's, it's, I just love Portland. I feel at home. She's not the only one on the team with local ties. Stanford assistant coach Katie Stedding is from here. She's born in Portland, went to Lake Oswego High School, and had an incredible career as a player. She's an Olympic gold medalist, national champion, first round WNBA draft pick. She even played for the Portland Power. Now she's back where it all started. Stanford faces three seed NC State, the Wolfpack, have traveled more than 2,800 miles, but it's good to be home for junior Katie Penoeta. She's from Vancouver, Washington, a star on the Heritage basketball team. Penoeta said she was praying her team would end up in Portland. I asked her what the ticket requests have been like, and let's just say everyone is coming to see her play tomorrow. With my player tickets, I was able to get like 50 people, but my dad texted me like 200 names to try to put on the list. And I'm like, you can bring the whole city of Vancouver, everybody in Portland, but I can only get you so many tickets. <laughs> Just the amount of love and support that has been poured out to me since, um, since people really found out on Selection Sunday about me coming to Portland. It's just been overwhelming in a, in a great way. Pretty funny, even some of her elementary school teachers have reached out to say, hey, we're planning to be there to watch you play. Now, one common denominator between both players, they made sure to say, we miss our pets. Pretty funny. NC State, Stanford, they'll play tomorrow to tip off the action starting at 4.30 here at Moda Center. Tim? All right, it's going to be good. Thanks a lot, Orlando.